That's Dave. It's Dick. And we're Dick and Dave. And normally we're in the studio down at Brick, giving you the 411 on what's fun to do in Brooklyn for the weekend. But um, this time we're out in the street to show you that we not only talk the talk, but we walk the walk. We're going to be walking the walk at the Crown Heights Immersion. So we're going to go to some of the best bars, uh, shops, restaurants in uh, Crown Heights, talk to people about what they like about the rapidly changing neighborhood, what they like to eat and buy here, and hopefully we will also be uh, getting some into ourselves. We're going to give you a taste of what Crown Heights is like via the Total Crown Heights Immersion. So stay tuned for that. And we're standing here with Katie from Brooklyn Brewery, which is a sponsor of the Total Crown Heights Immersion. The Immersion is an original series that Brooklyn based and Brooklyn Brewery came up with, I think, six years ago. You all do more than just Crown Heights, though. We do four a year. So this year we're going to Crown Heights, Gowanus, Bay Ridge, and East Williamsburg. The Rangers game is on, and uh, you know Dave is like the total, total, total Rangers fan. So I think um, without him thinking about the game, I should probably give him a mic so he can ask Katie a few questions himself. Who do you think is going to win the Ranger game? Uh, I only know that it's the Rangers game, so I hope the Rangers. That's a really good answer. The Total Crown Heights Immersion, like every other immersion in Brooklyn, is uh, a collaboration between Brooklyn Base and Brooklyn Brewery. And that is so Brooklyn, it's like the corner of Myrtle and Broadway. Hey, why start in Crown Heights this year? Um, it's it's where like half of our audience lives now so it's a good place to start also i mean basically we pick neighborhoods that have great bars good food that are just going to be like naturally a great crawl and a good day guanas we're hitting next on june 6th we've also done that twice but every time we come back to these neighborhoods there's a whole new slew of bars that have opened the neighborhoods change and it's good it's worth revisiting them and so it's another good day do you ever find yourself um wasted at the end of the uh, immersion? Yes, usually like, okay, so I ask people to come by three so that I can start to drink. That's really why I set this deadline. And so once everyone has right. checked in, then I can start to enjoy my day and move on to the other bars. And yeah, by the end of the day, I've, I've got a nice buzz on. You're going up on a Saturday? Yeah. We're here in the backyard of Kovenhoven. As you can see, there's real grass here, which is a, a miracle of uh, modern engineering or terraforming. What brought you to the immersion? Well, uh, I happen to be a resident of Crown Heights, and I do love to support you know, the community here. Very nice. How long have you lived here? Uh, about two years now. What, uh, what is your favorite part about living here in these two years that you've spent? Um, well, I think it's a wonderful community, and I think it's a growing neighborhood in a lot of different ways. And, uh, you know, I love beer, and I love a good time, and uh, I think it's wonderful to come out and, you know, support the uh, small businesses that are popping up. Do you have a favorite spot that you uh, like in Crown Heights? I am a big fan of Bergen that we were at earlier today, and I'm looking forward to going over to Catfish a little bit later. What do you like about Catfish? I love the ambiance. I love that, you know, it's, again, a, a small business in the, in the up-and-coming neighborhood. And, um, you know, it's a good time. Sure. I'm standing here with Lady J from Lady J Jewelry. Um, so Lady J, how has the total Crown Heights immersion been treating you? It's been great so far. Having lots of fun, serving up some mimosas, and meeting a lot of neighbors. Mm. <laughs> and as I spill stuff on myself, <laughs> I'm thinking, how amazing it is that Lady J actually makes the jewelry right here in the shop. Yeah, everything is handmade right here. So, and then we also feature other local Brooklyn-based designers and artisans. It's not just, you know, eating and drinking on the immersion tour. It's actually supporting a bunch of uh, artisans and small shops in the neighborhood. And I think it's very important because, you know, you need to wear something really cute when you go to meet your friend. <laughs> at a bar or at a restaurant. So I think stopping off at a place like this makes a lot of sense. Yeah, I think it's part of it. You want to not just, you know, enjoy the amazing food being made here and the great um, cocktails being served, but there's also, you know, a great thing about looking good and supporting other Brooklyn-based designers. I like the rock and the music and I like to the cha -cha -cha -cha. After all of that beer, after some of that food, I would like to say that the total immersion of Crown Heights 
is a success. Which one are you saying? There, there are two of you. Which one is saying that? Ooh, I think it's the one on the left. Or is that my right? I don't know. But it was a lot of beer. How'd you feel? I feel great. I think it was a really good time. We, uh, we ate some stuff. We drank some stuff. We talked to some people. They all seem to like Crown Heights. It's a good place to be. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. You know, so if you uh, even if you miss the Crown Heights total immersion, you want to come back to Crown Heights, you should do it. You should go to Comenhoven. You should go to Catfish. You should go to Bergen. You should go to Lady J's. Uh, you should even go to some of the places that we didn't even make it out here. Because it's a deep, 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 deep tour. Exactly. So, until next time, when you either see us in the studio or see us on the street, I'm right. Dave, you can find me at Brooklyn. I'm Dick Burrows, and you can find me at BK Reader, or the Brooklyn Reader. And ultimately, we came, we saw, we drunk beer. Really no, no, we drank beer. I'm drunk with beer.